Back when I was a kid, things were a little different than they are now. We didn't have everything just all regulated out. Uh, a veterinarian was usually just somebody that knew what they were, something about animals. But anyway, we had a guy in the neighborhood. We called him Uncle John. Uncle John, he had uh, kind of hung around and assisted a real vet for a little while, so when he got a little experience, he just took off on his own and started doctor. He had two big old horse needles, had ends on them, kind of like 20 penny nails. And he had vaccinate dogs and give different kinds of little shots and help deliver a, a calf occasionally. Most of though, uh, he, he was more of a psychologist. He was a kind of a grief counselor when his, when his medical expertise failed to, to uh, solve the problem. He kind of counseled the, the pet owners through their grief. But he had a he, he had a woman come in one time had this rabbit that was kind of puny, a pet rabbit. And so Uncle John says, well, I, I know what's wrong with that. Rabbit's got the flu. And he got his uh, one of his horse needles out and he had a bottle of Penicillin, you could buy it back then over the counter truckload there if you had the money, but he syringed up a big dose of that penicillin and crammed the needle down in that rabbit and shot it up and that rabbit just fell over. He just quivered and that's the end of it. Uncle John says, Die gun, if I'd have known that rabbit is that near dead, I never would have fooled with him. <laughs>